globe um L two oh one and L six two ten. Rail line midpoint C D setting midpoint and the other end should be perpendicular to the point A B perpendicular. Perpendicular to line AB, one end on line AB, the other end at midpoint on line CD. You can draw a line. You can um, select the first point anywhere. And the other end should be perpendicular to line CD. Perpendicular. Cancel. And we need to move this here, this intersection to midpoint of the line. Setting intersection and click midpoint midpoint. Now we need to trim this vertical line. So we can type trim click. And enter again. Right click cancel. Now this is uh, in the middle and it's perpendicular. And now eight. For this panel, we need to use uh, the command lengthen, and the length of the line is seven point seven, and uh, has one and has two point eight. So we draw a line. And should be perpendicular to the line cancel and use command lengthen total click on total and enter the length seven point oh six one enter. And click on the line. So it's in the middle, and here is a perpendicular to line, and the length is 7.066. To double check that, you can use command measure, and you can select the intersection setting. Intersection and enter. Seven, seven point and L nine.
a line par parallel to line city with lanes 3.456 with one end at mid And then again, put the length of the line and then length in total three point four five six point five six, and we need to move to. The length is three point four five six and it's at midpoint it's at mid and it's parallel to the line Point from A to B like so, like so, and then draw a circle. Circle here, and the radius. The radius is the radius. Point. Again, for other M, circle, point seven five. And now we can trim the extra one. Trim, enter again. And we need to delete this circle press. Now the length here is uh, 0.5 from here to 0.5 and from here to here is 0.4. For panel line we need to visible to make it green. 